。欧盟上会星期三举行嘅经济展望新闻发布会，中国分会会长约格尔伍德克介绍咗欧盟在华企业目前嘅处境。Not surprising, the economic slowdown that we experience is on the 伍德克表示毫无疑问，欧盟所经历嘅经济放缓系所有公司面临嘅最紧要问题，而佢哋需要面对嘅最大挑战。呢、这個唔單止係歐洲嘅公司嘅問題，而係喺所有喺中國嘅企業嘅問題。佢所講嘅意思就係話，亦都包括中國嘅公司。喺被問到歐洲在華企業如何應對目前嘅經濟挑戰嘅時候，伍特克表示，財源可能係最簡單以及係最直接嘅應對之道。And to our surprise, a little bit head counting came out first, meaning that people seriously are l i n g off people. 到有啲吃驚嘅就係計算人員成本成為當務之急。呢個就係話公司通過財源令到公司瘦身，以便能夠更加靈活咁應對更加困難嘅投資環境。伍特克仲表示，面临住经济困境，中国政府急需要进一步实行经济改革，通过改革管理体制以及系健全法制嚟实现平稳过渡In order to make their companies uh, slimmer uh, and uh, more nimble, in order to tackle a more difficult uh, investment climate. Members' confidence in reform, given that there's been ten months since the. But there's a sense of urgency uh, in the community, meaning that uh, the anticipation is reforms are needed now. The old toolbox uh, is not working as good as it used to be. The new toolbox is not in place yet, and uh, the regulatory framework, the rule of law, and other areas. Uh, are definitely needed in order to make that transition. Perceptions that you will now hear about from our European Chamber President. Your... 